most of my life, I never had a voice. You see, I was born into a life of violence. At a very young age, I became a victim of sex trafficking. I was sold for drugs. This did not happen in another country. It happened right here in the United States. In fact, it continues to happen all the time, all over the United States. They took me away from my biological parents. I was kidnapped. At age five, they started grooming me. I was locked in a closet. It could be days, depending on what they wanted. At age 11, they barcoded me. That's the way they identified me, who I belonged to. I became nothing more than their property. At 16, I escaped for the first time. I was living in the streets, sleeping under tunnels, eating whatever I could find. I had no place to go because this gang is very powerful. They would pick me up from the streets and take me back when they saw me. This happened to me four times. They would beat me up and threaten me to kill me and move me from city to city. Not even the police could help me. They were often bribed to look the other way. I could not trust anyone. Finally, when I was in my 20s, I escaped for good. I started wearing wigs, hats, anything to disguise my identity. Because of all this, I never went to school, and I never learned to read or write. During that time, I wanted to give up. A friend helped me find places where I met other women who had stories like mine. They also told me about adult education classes. Adult education gave me life again, because my dream is to get my GED. I have a team now. I am not alone. Sometimes I feel frustrated and think that I can't reach my goal. But I know that I can because I survived the hardest and most painful thing that ever happened to me. Even with my learning disability, I'm making strides in learning, reading, writing, math, and science. When I get my GED, I would like to be a social worker to help other girls and adults who are suffering as I did to build their self-esteem so they too can be part of our community. A few years ago, I had my barcode transformed into a butterfly. The chain has been broken. I am free now. I used to think of myself as a victim, but now I am a survivor.